Let's wrap up with a wonderful question here. Let's drive through. So what is the question going to ask? It's going to ask, calculate the amount of research and development costs that should be expensed for the current year. All right, great. Well, let's run through here. And I don't want to spoil it for you, even though I just kind of went to that slide. But you didn't look, right? You didn't look at all. No, that was too quick for you to, for you to check it out. Well, let's see. All right. I'm going to run through, give you a second to think about it. We are looking to we are looking for what's expensed. And obviously everything else is capitalized. Now let's see. Okay. What about materials used in R&D projects? Is that going to be expensed? I am going to say it will be expensed. We are going to include that as expense because it's R&D. Nothing's mentioned about technological feasibility. These are not capital assets, it's just materials, so expense. What about equipment acquired that has alternate future uses in future research and development projects? Well, if you remember from our research and development chapter, we have alternate future uses for this. Maybe you buy a machine that makes, I don't know, a, a medicine, and then it can be used for something afterward. Well, that's going to be capitalized, and we'll reuse it for something else after. So that's not included as an expense. How about depreciation on this equipment? Depreciation on the equipment there, are we going to include that? Well, you, you might think, okay, well, it's on something that we didn't include, so we don't include it. But I mean, depreciation, depreciation expense. You always expense depreciation, right? That's what you do. So that's included. All right. What about personnel costs and people involved in R&D project? Well, this is going to be expensed as well because it's R&D salaries expense. What about consulting fees paid to outsiders for R&D projects? Going once, going twice, and sold to those of you who thought expensed. Yep, expensed there as well. And lastly, indirect costs reasonably allocable to research and development projects. Again, another item that will be expensed for us here. For those of you who want to see the answer, so no, I'm not lying. Here we are.